Hi, I'm Kelsey Kinnear and I'm a registered dietitian at Boone Hospital Center and today I'm going to make a veggie tray for you guys. Pretty simple, I know a lot of people just buy veggie trays at the store, it's an easy grab and go type one, but I do want to emphasize that you can make it really beautiful and diverse and like kind of special for your parties and that it can be something that people get really excited about. So I want to start with making a dip and it's really only three ingredients, it's got feta cheese, which I just picked feta because it's my favorite, um, but you could use a lot of cheeses for this. And um, it has roasted, jarred red peppers. Um, so I'm using a whole container of feta and then just a few roasted peppers. And then I'm gonna add some garlic. And they smell so good. <laughs> Not a lot though, I don't really want it to be the main, I want the feta to be the main consistency. Um, so I'll start with that and see how it looks. And then I'm just adding a little bit of garlic. So let's see how this looks. I like to pour a little bit of the liquid in too, just to kind of thin it out. It has oil in it and a lot of good flavor. So. If you wanted to add olive oil to this to make it even creamier, you could, but I'm going to leave it pretty thick. Um, so the veggie tray that I chose today was kind of a rectangle. Obviously, you can do whatever you have at your house, but um, ideally, you're going to be cutting the veggies into sizes of kind of long, long dippable sizes, or for things like these radishes, I just leave them whole. It's great if you can try to have the veggies not be too thin because then they get kind of wimpy. Um, and if you look for veggies at the store that are kind of more in their early state, like the baby zucchini and things like that, they're more tender. So that would be ideal. Obviously in the summer there might be more options like that. Um, but this is kind of like feta and lots of strong flavors in this so the veggies kind of mellow it out. I think a lot of us have good intentions when we're bringing a veggie tray to a party, meaning that we're wanting to try to uh, you know, make new habits for ourselves, new healthier habits, because it's really easy to just grab the buffalo chicken dip or the chi bag of chips. Um, but I just encourage you to just think of this in a new way, not just of like, oh I want to make a healthier version of this appetizer. Instead think just bring in more veggies, they're beautiful, they add richness and color. Um, they, they don't have to be super hard, like if you want, you have time maybe in the morning, you can prep them ahead by cutting them that morning, maybe wrapping them in damp paper towels in a Ziploc. The sooner you can chop it before preparing it, the better, just because it's more fresh. But super simple, colorful, maybe a little expensive. Um, you can always try to choose on sale veggies and you don't have to do too much crazy things if you just want to do like your typical broccoli and cauliflower type veggies, that's fine. But I did choose like purple carrots that I saw. They have those at Aldi, I know. Um, like crunchy cucumbers, zucchini, like raw zucchini, if it's tender enough, can be really good in a dip. These are golden beets, radishes I left whole, fresh green beans, green onions. So think outside the box. Um, but yeah, hope you guys think about adding a veggie tray to your next party. Thanks.